Hey guys, I'm Yulia and I'm back with the correct answers to our recent little quiz concerning some facts about Russia. So I presented 10 facts about my country and three of those were wrong. Let's see what the truth is like. Number one. The most popular pets in Russia are cats and dogs. But wealthy Russians who live in the country and have big houses can afford to keep a brown bear. Of course, it's false. I don't know a single story like that. And all the bears I've seen in my life were kept in zoos. Although I did find some videos on social media of some people keeping bears in their houses. But these stories are usually the exceptions to the norm. Number two. McDonald's, located in the center of Moscow, near Pushkinskaya metro station, holds the record number of people that had visited any McDonald's on the planet in one day. It's true. The first McDonald's in Moscow was opened in 1990 and set the world record of 30,000 people visiting on this particular date. Number three. Sunflower oil is the most popular oil in Russia for cooking. It's true. Also, olive oil is rather popular nowadays, but its popularity can be compared with sunflower oil. Olive oil is considered more elite, I would say. Number 4. One metro pass in Moscow costs 190 rubles, which are about $2.50. It's false. It costs 60 rubles. It's about 80 US cents. Number 5. Russians don't have a respectful form of addressing people, like Mr., Miss, or Mrs., Senor, Senora, and others. It's true. In fact, we have forms like Gospodin, Sir, Gospoda, Gentleman. But nobody really uses them. It's both very formal and obsolete. When addressing strangers, we usually use женщина, woman, девушка, girl, мужчина, man and молодой человек, young man. Number six. A Russian novel War and Peace is a mandatory part of the country's school program, but almost none of the students read it during their school years. It's true. I don't know a single person who read it at school. I did it only last year and should admit its language is not easy even for adults. Number seven. The biggest museum in the world is Hermitage which is situated in St. Petersburg. It's false. The biggest museum in the world is the Louvre in Paris. Hermitage comes in second due to its also significant size. Number eight. There are only four kilometers between Russia and the USA. It's true. Of course, not between Moscow and Washington, but between two tiny islands in the Bering Strait. A little diamond island USA and Big Diamond Island, Russia. Number nine. The only way to address teachers at schools is to use their first name and their patronymic name. Otherwise, it's not polite at all. It's true. This is the only way. Like Anna Ivanovna or Ivan Petrovich. It's also a respectful manner not only in the field of education, but in other areas as well. Number ten. Public high school education in Russia is free of charge. Also, many state universities offer free higher education to those students who are bright enough. It's true. There are also private schools in Russia, both foreign and domestic. But the state schools are much more numerous and yes, they are free. Scholarship options do exist for some universities, but getting one is not as easy as it seems. So, that's it for today. Please comment on whether you like this kind of format with facts about Russia and what did you find to be the weirdest fact. Thank you for your time. See you. Пока-пока.